right here and this is from Bumbleberry Paper Crafts. So first up, I oh, got two things. So first up is this Honeybee Stamps Easter Eggs. Oh, as well as Coordinating Stencil. You see all those different designs. That would be pretty neat. I'm wondering, is there a yes. code for it? That one cost me six ninety nine. <clears throat> Next up, we have a give it a whirl lawn fawn. Metal die. This one was twenty four forty nine. Normally, I you know wait until things go on sale, but I really wanted to get this to try it out because I thought it was pretty cool. Because I watched um <clears throat> the uh, demo about this. I can't remember who it was now. It was on. I, I can't remember. So, but it was pretty cool. And you know this um, mechanism thing, I swear I saw something similar on the uh, third Harry Potter illustrated book by, you know, the Neil Lima version, new versions that are coming out. I'm pretty sure I saw that on the uh, a divination teacup page that's yeah, that's the interactive thing where you use a spoon and you stir the full teacup and it shows the inside tea leaves after it's fin finished. And so I think that's this mechanism from what I could see. So well, that's pretty cool. <clears throat> so this, I don't know if you're wondering. So let's see. Whirl the tab around your scene or sentiment to magically reveal more layers of fun. Combine it with your favorite critters or sentiments for infinite creative possibilities. Pair it with the Give It a Whirl Scalloped add-on, LF3367, for a cute scalloped edge. The circle base is 3.5 inches by 3.5 inches. The inner circle is 2.78 inches by 2.78 inches. <clears throat> and we also like feature above, which is the foiled sentiments sending rainbows, LF3387, kangarifics, LF3344, which are sold separately. Those are all cute. Okay. Hey. Anyway, oh, yes, this is LF3366. If you're wondering, yeah. But. And speaking of the scallops add-on, ta-da! I thought why not, you know? <clears throat> not sure what to do about the uh, the inner things because that's kind of almost the same. Obviously, this is is that the same size? Or is it not? It does look slightly different. Maybe. The grass was in there. And obviously the front part does look different because it's like a wavy and this is just a straight. But anyway, who knows, I might even use it in a snow globe thing, so it might be useful for that. Who knows? <coughs> But here's the add-on, scalloped add-on, give it a whirl. Same thing on the back, but this scalloped base is 3 and 5 eighths inches by 3 and 5 eighths inches. This product is an add-on, it is intended to be used with give it a whirl LF3366, so it's separate. And the, what is it, 
what things have done most all separate way as well, obviously. This is F3367. <clears throat> so yes, that that was all of it. I didn't really get very many. Just these three. I was tempted to get a a couple other things, but uh it's low on cash, so I had to choose wisely. And since I, my main reason was for buying this for these two, I was thinking of getting or looking up something like this a while ago. So I decided this over clouds. But right, oh yes, and um the add-on was fifteen pound forty nine. So not much cheaper actually than the uh, <clears throat> the, uh, the main guy at twenty four forty nine. But uh, let's see, the shipping was three ninety nine. So the total came down to fifty pounds ninety six. Ouch. But anyway, normally I don't really get new new releases because I think this is a really recent release. At least by the time I'm recording this, it is still February. Most likely this will be going up in April. I has to say, I guess. Anyway, yes. So I'm looking forward to trying this out when I get around to making something. <laughs> <clears throat> Oh yes, so that is it. Do check out Bumbleberry Paper Crafts. They have, especially if you're in the UK, they have great international brands like Lawn Fawn, Honeybee Stamps. They do have Spellbinders on there too, but Spellbinders has its own UK site now, so I can buy off that one for that. Um, let's see, what else do they have? Altenoon, Gina K Designs. Um, Justin Hovey, some of those. Um, because I th I believe Lawn Farm stuff you can't find on Craft Stash, which is unfortunate. I believe I'm correct. I think I'm right. But, uh, yes. They have other, other brands, you know, Tim Holtz Ranger for their distress oxides and stuff. <clears throat> yes, I'm just waffling now. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Leave it all for notifications. I haven't said that in a while. It just kind of rolls off the tongue after I've been saying it for years. Um, uh, over and out.